G'day everyone. Uh, some popular videos of mine have been the speed farming videos. So in this one, I will be speed farming um, tier eight, Beacon of the Boiling Flame C. I was super lucky in my last video and I had two immolating flames drop, which are currently going for about 400 flame elementium. Um, so these keys are a little bit more expensive so Beacon of the Dark Knight are absolutely worthless. Um, you can get five for one Flame Elementium, but that's because the card, uh, specific card that drops from there is not worth much at all. It drops Flame Sand. Ooh, yay. Whereas the one from here drops and it's worth 400. Um, so these beacons cost about 1.5 each. I've had all these drops, so I haven't bought any. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to be working off the fact that I have 78 and the cost will be 1.5 each, even though you could buy a crap ton for less than that. Um, anywho, so that is what that is. My trait deck that I am running for this test is uh, extra monsters, that is not right at all. Let me reset that. Alrighty, the trait deck that we are running is extra monsters, chance for flame sand to drop and be multiplied, um, chance for uh, bosses to drop an additional rank five beacon, chance for uh, beacons to be upgraded from the nether realm cards. I haven't had this happen yet, but I'm still hopeful. Um, Chance for God of War to spawn. That just makes you zip through the map even faster. Chance for Dark Surge. Use it at the very end. Extra monsters are corroded. And chance for a boss for the Edicts. Um, people say that Dark Surge is garbage, but if you get commodity every six or seven maps, most of the time you'll get 20, 10 to 20 flame elements in from that, which is quite crazy. Um, so let's do um, a map together. Hopefully I don't die because I gained 84% of my level in the last series of videos. Uh, so losing that would, uh, would suck a lot. Um, but uh, hopefully we don't, I guess. Um, the pack scripts that I am using are the Flame Elementium and then switching to the Season Pack Scripts um, for the Nightmare. If you want to see the effect that Pack Scripts have on your drops, I have uploaded a 7-2 uh, with this same setup and a... Um, 7-2 with no drop scripts at all. Um, so you can compare those videos to this one if you like uh, to see how much difference it is. I forgot the timer. Alrighty, we have a timer going now. It was about one minute for that map, so not too bad. You may be wondering why I went with that two and not the other twos. Well, I have a, an absolute ton of the other resources already. Um, commodity gives us another red. Nether Realm gives us another red. Nether Realm is rather strong. Uh, if you get some rank five beacons, you are going to be far ahead of if you got um, commodities. Go in there and kill that guy. The enemies with the purple uh, border are quite strong. Quite scary that I'm uh, trying to not lose any XP. But they also drop quite well. Uh, the gear that they drop is really nice. He dropped a... Ooh, that's dangerous. Bit of flame elementium in there. I've got the lightning, so these ones should die pretty quick. Just run through, oh, something dropped back here. Flame Elementium. Kill the boss. Trigger that and leave. I will see you at the first 
Um, did I show my pack scripts? I'll quickly show my pack scripts. If you do the two and the other options are fours and sixes and the rewards aren't phenomenal, uh, you are better off getting the extra 100% um, the extra 100% drop quant from the confusion part of the two stage cards. Uh, I have Chalk Spirit, uh, Gathering, cl Cloud Gatherer, Surging Gold. Here's a Flame Elementium uh, drop rate. Happy Chonky is a Flame element Elementium drop rate. Um, and I just got um, Chalk Spirit in a Lucky 10 draw. Um, and on the Nightmares, I'll be using the Nightmare pack scripts for an extra 12% um, chance for the bubbles to repeat on each um, node, as well as some drop quantity. And the Shepherd has a 50% chance to give me an extra uh, Dream Omen when I enter the area. Hopefully I don't forget to switch back um, between Nightmares. Anyway... I'll see you in a bit. Alrighty, so we have our first... Um, our first nightmare here. It should be pretty juicy. I've switched to my um, nightmare packed scripts. So we can utilize the benefits there. We've got a pretty juicy one to start off with, so I am expecting great things. Hopefully I don't die, because that would suck. I forgot he does that extra move as well. He almost one-shot me on 7-2 uh, with his charge, so I dare say his charge will kill me. Um if I get hit. So let's just quickly clear, then I'll come back and loot once. Ooh, oh, jeebus. Oh boy. What hit me then? I don't know, but I don't want it. I don't like it. Please don't do that again. Oh, almost got hit by the charge. Look out for those waves, go in between. If I didn't have 88% XP, I would not care. But I do, so I care. <laughs> uh, Alright, so what'd we get? We got... Not as much as I thought. I thought we would have got a bunch more rank 5 plus beacons. Got a compass, which is nice, but we're not tracking that. Let's go back and grab the other loot that we missed. One, two, three, rank five plus beacons there. Um, one, two, three there as well. So we made, I don't know, a hundred or so flame elementium uh, right there. Switch back to the flame elementium pack scripts and keep on going. The flames that burn the heart. Well, I got the right base, but uh, they didn't really upgrade. Um, and then what is this? Garbage. Gear, fluorescent, no thanks. Let's just upgrade one. We only got one extra red bubble. Got a few more five plus beacons there, which isn't too bad. Another compass. Three or four. Alrighty, we're at the end of another one. Um, one community bubble is probably not that great, so let's just upgrade one. And uh, you can come along for the ride, because I really don't want to die pausing the video. And, um, yeah. I'm on 97%. I kind of just want to get the level. Oh, fuck me. Um, I 
And then after I get the level, it won't matter as much, you know? <sighs> My poor heart. Will it survive this video or will I have a heart attack? That is a Z question. The boost is back. I was hoping he would dis uh, teleport, but no, it's okay. All right, last one's just here. That little ice guy can piss off. That is such a huge area to just spray with ice. Uh, it's actually more deadly than the boss. All right, kill the pimple and we're done. See what loot we get. We've been super lucky getting uh, three Netherrealm ones in a row. Uh, but that's why we do two hours to see, you know, an average. I've already done a two hour video today, so. Um, switch back. Yeah, I'll see you at the next one. Do you reckon this guy's gonna give me my level? Or kill me? If I don't move. Ah, oh, I didn't do either. Lame. Lame! Guess I need to do another map. Gosh, didn't even get it in the next map. Hey, we got our level. Yay, now I'll die 6,000 times. Ah, oh, triggered on 50%. Boom. Um. No thanks. Ah, oh, could have done the, uh, Commodity would have been nice. Oh, that was a bit underwhelming. No, it triggered. I'm meeting. Sorry. Are you ready for this? That's a juicy one, Exile. Nah. That's an, a decent invading uh, dude. Place of Oracle. Don't know what that is. No! It triggered at 10%. This is going to be a bad one. Um, yeah. There's a chance. <clears throat> All blues and whites. Gross. A shiny mechanical compass was the best thing that dropped. A bit sad. Alrighty, probably could have done another map or so, uh, but we'll call that the first hour there. Uh, trade house, what's sold? Ooh, hello. Uh, anywho, I'll bring up the spreadsheet and we'll go through it. Alrighty, using the usual format, we have our uh, things that we are tracking, which is flame elementium, flame sand, uh, lost Secrets, etc. Let's do the uh, Rank 5 Beacons first. Uh, yep, that's the right one. <laughs> Wasn't sure if it was the right window then. I got two open. Um, rank 5, Lava and Glacial. We got 6 and uh, 14. So 20 of those, which is insane. Um, and we got... 19 of the others. Let's find the lost secrets, etc. 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 So we've got 17 lost secrets, um, 16 and 29. Supernova explosions. I didn't notice any. I don't think any dropped. Um, oh, we have two. Okay. Two dropped. And that brings us to a whopping total of almost 800 flame elementium for the first hour. Granted, we did get pretty lucky with the um, rank five beacons. Um, if we remove those, it comes down to only 300 flame elementium an hour, which is still pretty good. But 
that's what we had. So that's what we're going to uh, leave in there. Uh, I'll crack on with the second hour momentarily. Um, and uh, yeah, go from there. Hopefully we get some immolating flames. Seeing those two sell um, just then is very, very pleasing to my soul. And uh, I'll see you in a minute. You know what's actually crazy? When you haven't checked the price of something for a couple of days and you've expected the price to go down. But I don't know why the price of these are going up. Must be something to do with making you know, a thousand FD an hour doing them. But <clears throat> I mean, I'm all for it because that just means that we made actually more currency than we thought was actually 900 flame elementium an hour. Correction. I forgot the cost. I forgot the cost. We had 72 beacons. We've had some drop while we've been doing them. Um, so we've technically used 13 uh, beacons, which 13 times... 1.5 cost, it actually cost us 19 flame elementium. So we have to remember to subtract 20 flame elementium from the total, just so we are completely square, you know? Alrighty, let's crack on with the second hour of this lucrative test. Um, also, side note, if you like watching people die in solo self-found hardcore, please feel free to check out my brother's Twitch channel. Uh, he streams most Aussie days uh, about this time, which is, um, I'd say, from 10 a.m. AS Australian Eastern Standard Time. Um until late afternoon so a good six hours most of the time um so twitch.tv forward slash signal he's the one that made the uh, loot filter that i'm using unfortunately the loot filters are region locked so um until we create a character on every single realm and create the um, code for each realm. Unfortunately, uh, they well, the um, what am I trying to say? The code that I have will only work on the Asia servers, unfortunately. Uh, but we will sort that out shortly. He said he was going to do that last night. Ooh, that's tempting. That's tempting. Yeah, let's do it. <clears throat> let's do it. We'll use a um, compass when we get to that stage. I have been burnt before where the kin just don't spawn. Um, fluorescent, netherrealm, rainbow netherrealm. Uh, yes, please. Give me six netherrealms, please. I would love, 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 love some juicy, juicy stuff. Look at that. We just had... A 5 plus beacon drop in the map, which just means that this map's been 10 FE already, at least. Um, what would cap this off is if an immolating flame dropped, and then if the um, dark surge at the end was compasses. We're not trucking compasses, but I would love for this map to just be worth, you know. 600 flame elementium. It wasn't. It, it, it was a d disaster. Um, but anyway. That's fine. We've still got a couple of flame elementium. I'll see you soon. Yeah, that's not bad. We've got some compasses. Pretty nice. Nice, 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 nice. Not tracking those, but still nice. Come on, do three. Oh, I did. Oh, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, we've got the six. Whew. They're crap, but we're getting a rainbow. 
Alrighty, this, the drop from here is not in the test. However, they are worth a bit, I think. I haven't checked in a few days. Uh, I'm not going to juice because I don't want um, to affect the rest of the maps. I just want to guarantee that this drops. So I'm using a compass on that. Um, and we'll see what we get from this map. We're probably going to trigger the uh, nightmare anyway. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I triggered anyway. So we'll do the nightmare, then I'll see you at the end of the nightmare, and then we'll do the map. Alrighty, we didn't get lucky and the rainbow wasn't duplicated. However, in the great words of Megami, explosion! Oh, that was, f that was lame! What is going on? Man. What a letdown. Anticlimactic to the maximum. Gosh. I was excited. Not anymore, though. Hope this map's better. How many of the um, keys do we have? We have four. Alrighty, let's see what we get. A couple. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 50, 100 billion. Quadrillion. That's how my son counts. Just goes from, you know, nothing to a quadrillion. Ooh, nice, nice, nice. We had four. We're going to have to check what we've got at the end. Because that's a pretty decent card. Guaranteed two. Uh, I've seen it with just one as well, which is yeah, it's still okay. If you get two packs like that. Um, so that should have been 10 per pack, I believe. There's five guys in each pack. Unlike the burger joint, those five guys are good. Uh, the burger joint is a garbage. Not a fan of five guys, if you didn't tell. Couldn't tell. Come on, give us a doom. Give me doom. Doom, 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 doom. Nothing again. Where's my edicts at, bro? I'm crying poor over here. I've been farming for three days and I've only got 7,000 flame elements here. Uh, so what did we get? We indeed got 24... Price check, they're five each, or six each. They get to six pretty quick. So, I guess that's 120 flame elementium that we're not counting. Uh, which is bonkers. Um, <laughs> that's actually crazy that I'm not going to count that 120. G'day everyone, I was a little bit distracted just then. Uh, the Crow's Corner was on, so if you quickly use this code uh, in-game you will uh, get a nice reward. Uh, it's normally active for about uh, 24 hours. So if you do that, you can get 200 Jagged Primo Crist, um, but you have to be quick as, uh, yeah, it's very limited time. Uh, anyway, back to the video. See how this one goes. Only wind bubbles, so it's probably not going to be that amazing. Uh, we've got one, two, only two rank five plus beacons there. So, okay, but not amazing. Spam A. And I missed some loot over here, it seems. The wind bubble dropped nothing. Anyway, be back soon. Finally got an edict. Nice, another edict. Alrighty, we got a decent commodity one going. Um, let's see if that's any good. It's not too bad. I uh, don't see any stacks of 10 in there though. Oh, there's one stack of 10. Nice. Oh, 30 minutes to go. I am getting so shafted for every three commodity bubbles. I'm up to 
twenty percent or or thirty percent or something, and I haven't had a single friggin' one getting trolled. Thirty percent, yeah. Haven't had a single commodity option yet. Or a whim. I guess an edict doom is nice though. Finally. I had three whim bubbles. <laughs> and now it's ended. See what the loot's like. Commodity bubble's the main one. Eh, got a little bit. Ooh, a fly, five plus. That was worth. I think that was out of a white. Which is pretty crazy. Anyway, 20 minutes left. Now this is a tough one. I need three netherrealm bubbles. I can go one to three or add two. I think I just add two. Um, nightmare moves move around. It's a bit annoying. Now I'm hoping this doesn't proc. Ah, procced. Pray that we get an extra. We did. And good. One to three. We've got two reds. Wow. That's RNG. Holy balls. The crazy thing about this is I killed the root here. And it was originally from way down there. It drops the loot wherever it was originally um, stationed. Which is pretty crazy. Um, but at least it died on here. So it's easy to loot all the bubbles. So we've got a pretty decent one to finish off. Uh, I doubt I'll get another one before the end. I will continue going for the rest of the time though. I have an interesting um, trait card going. So I'll see you at that. Alrighty, so I got the legendary divinity cube. Um, I'm going to add a uh, compass to this anyway. I don't think the compass is going to do anything, but I've got 11 of them sitting there. I don't, I don't care. Just in case. I have had the Eterna one spawn before, and uh, it, I didn't use a compass, and the mobs just didn't bother to rock up. So, um, better safe than sorry, and you watch it drop me two div slates that are worth absolutely nothing. Um... Which is what happened the last time I had this one. Um, I don't have the cube um, cards in that give me more desire incarnations, unfortunately. Um, but I've had this twice for this entire um, season, so it's not really something you can rely on. What do I get? Corner of Divinity, two Corner of Divinities. Alright. Is that all? Do I get another one? Does that count? Ah, oh, it wasn't the um, Malice, whatever. Dude. So it looks like two Corners of Divinity are it. Uh, I'll do the cube just because. Might get another corner of divinity, you know. Or a bunch of worthless wedges. One of the two. Lame. It's a six stage for one additional fleeting. No thank you. Alrighty, we had one proc. Oh, whoops. I didn't use my Beeble. Oh well. I'll see if it activates still. I don't know. I feel like you have to activate your pack script before using this. But I guess we'll see pretty soon. Activated. Interesting. We got one rank five plus beacon there. Uh, 
And we've just gone over the two hour mark, so I'll finish this one off and the map, and then we'll be done. Beep, 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 beep. You don't need to see this. Oh, <laughs> can't believe I died. I failed. I lost the bubble. I lost the booble. I wonder what color I lost. I don't really lose anything. Uh, profound and supernova explosion. A couple of supernovas actually. A few compasses. Alright, I'll see you back in town. Alrighty, one of the two uh, corner of divinities that we got is worth three flame elementium and the other one appears to be worth about 520. So that's pretty lucky. That's not counted, uh, but you can count that if you want. Uh, looking at the um, flame fuel, we got 283, which is more uh, flame. We got more commodity drops this time and less nether realm um, <clears throat> Nightmares for the cards. We've got a few there. We've got less cards this time. And we got uh, less uh, rank 5 beacons. Uh, we got a, a few nice edicts. I didn't realize the edicts have gone back up to 45 flame elementium each. These were down to 6 the other day. I was about to make a, a Keegan video. Um, but the price of these has skyrocketed. Uh, which is quite interesting. Um, back to the spreadsheet. Uh, there are the totals and the honourable mentions on the side here. So the honourable mentions is an extra, what, 647, 710 flame elementium of extra stuff that is not counted in the totals. Um, so the second hour, we got 650 flame elementium of tracked drops. Uh, in reality, it was more like 1300. Um, so a grand total of four, uh, two hours of uh, farming 8-0 with no uh, nether realm boosts, no compasses, etc. Uh, we got 1,549 flame elementium for an hourly rate of 774 flame elementium, which is quite insane. Uh, if we added in the other 710 uh, FE below, um, equals 648 plus 710, uh, it, it's over a thousand flame elementium an hour, um, which is quite crazy. Uh, don't forget to use the Crow's Corner code before it expires. Um, it'll probably expire within 24 hours. So make sure you get your free Primcast crystals. Uh, that's all I have for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later.